Welcome fans and collectors. This is Marvel and DC 379 with another review and today we'll be looking at Funko Pop X-Men Psylocke. This was actually given to me by my dad so I have to thank him because if it weren't for him this review wouldn't happen and before I begin I have to say that Psylocke is one of my favorite Marvel characters, my second favorite X-Men character behind Wolverine, and my favorite female superhero or superheroine. Because I know a lot of people would normally say Wonder Woman or Black Widow, but Psylocke is my superhero go-to gal. So, okay, let's begin. It says Pop. X-Men, which is in the series. This is number 180. Psylocke. And there's that great artwork of her. Look at the side. It says her name. And here's the other figures you can get in this series. Okay, so... Let's take a good look at her. I really love Psylocke as a character. As I said before, I just love reading about her. Though, though I really did enjoy her, her appearance in X-Men Apocalypse. It's not much, but I, I liked it for what it was. It's the usual Funko stylized bobblehead with the big head with small body, odd proportions, but that's on purpose because I know a lot of people love see super deformed stuff. Like, since I, I like collecting Gundam, they have super deformed Gundam model kits. And I have to say, the detail is really great. It looks just like her in the style of a Funko Pop bobblehead. There's her katana sword because she is a ninja and her energy knife. The way the energy knife is, I'm going to assume that her body is a translucent plastic but they painted over it. That's what I think. I could be wrong but I'm not complaining. For accessories, well, as I said, she has her sword, her energy knife, and the base, which is a separate piece. The only thing I have to nitpick about is that without the stand, it's very top-heavy, so it can't really stand without the stand. Because if I let this go without my hand, it would just topple over. So if you ever get this figure, I highly recommend having her on the stand. Let me see if I can get her on. But overall, I think this is a really great Funko. So I really do recommend her if you're a big Psylocke fan like me. Or if you just love Funko overall. And I've never met someone who doesn't like Funko. So thank you for watching everybody. This is... Marvel and DC 379 with this review saying Excelsior, true believers.